All right. Well, let's reminisce on some incredible moments that we've seen from Team USA and Team Venezuela in pool play, starting with number five. We were just talking about him. It was Lance Lynn's outing against Canada. Yeah, so number five, top five moments that we've seen from USA and Venezuela so far. Number five, Lance Lynn's outing against Canada. Not only was the outing great, five innings, two hits, one earned run, six Ks, great outing. Aside from that, the what it meant to the team. Losing to Mexico, then having to come out. And guess what? If you lose, you're going home. Yeah. Having Lance Lynn go out with that performance was one of the top moments for me. Number four, Team USA putting up nine runs in the first inning against Canada. Kind of the same same game. Yep. Same moment. You know, you needed everybody to show up, and that was the game that USA showed up. Team USA scored nine runs in the first inning of the game. It started very quickly. Mike Trout, Mookie Betts starting things off hot. And the, the cool thing about this is it was my pump-up speech that I think got the guys going uh, in our pregame show. We'll I, you I finished it off with a big pump-up speech of, you know, pumping these guys up. And from what I heard from, from everybody is uh-huh. that they had that speech on in the locker room. And they were like, you know what? Ben's right. Ben's right. And they went out there and they scored nine runs in the first inning. Though in my speech, uh-huh. I said I'm expecting a 10 spot yeah. in the first Early. inning. They did nine. Um, Just close. Close enough. Actually, yeah. I did say I said 10 runs within the first three innings. They did that. So yep. even more than I thought. They definitely yeah, they listened. listened. Yeah. And remember, that game came after their embarrassing loss to Team Mexico. So they kind of had that needed revenge motivation attitude. Hopefully we see that, just that same aggression through the rest of the tournament. I sure hope so. Okay, let's move on to number three, and it's Venezuela's dominance over the Dominican Republic. Ah, Venezuela tabbed themselves very very early on as a favorite in this tournament because, well, they dominated the actual favorite. The Dominican came into this tournament, the the favorite to win, the betting favorite, whatever you went, you walking down the street, who's going to win? Six out of ten people would probably pick the Dominican. Yep. They were the favorite to win this. Venezuela comes out in that very first game and dominates them Mm -hmm. all around, every facet of the game. They looked great, announced their presence very quickly, and really never looked back from there. Went undefeated in pool play, dominated who they should have dominated, played really well, played tough competition. I can't stress this enough. This is going to be a very tough game for the United States. This is definitely the toughest opponent yet. Yes, it is. All right, number two, Team Venezuela pranking Escobar with a fake cat. Yeah, I don't know if you know about this one, Alex. this for everybody This is great. So Eduardo Escobar is petrified of cats. So So weird. So this entire tournament, they have been pranking him by either saying that there's a cat nearby, and they actually ended up getting a fake cat to throw at him at all times and put on his head and bring in actual cat. They have been scaring the crap out of Eduardo Escobar with this fake cat. It has been, <laughs> it's been great to see some of the tweets rolling in. Eduardo Escobar is scared of cats and Team Venezuela keeps, <laughs> keeps throwing them at him with a, keeps startling him yeah. with a stuffed one, stuffed cat in the locker room, scaring him. It's a great, it's great. What I love about this is just seeing the team camaraderie <laughs> and seeing how much fun that they're having throughout this entire tournament, which is huge if you want to go far and you want to win this thing. That's what this that's what this tournament becomes all about because is is the best team on the field going to win the tournament? Maybe, but what you need to see is camaraderie in the locker room, fun, energy, passion. Yeah. Single elimination once you get to a certain point. You can't afford to lose. Single elimination, different than we see in the Major League Baseball playoffs. If you have one night that's off, if you come out lacking energy one night, done. you're done. You're You're out. And Venezuela's bringing the energy every night. All right. And number one top moment from USA Venezuela is Trout's home run and salute. It's incredible. It's, It's great. That's Team USA has a captain. His name is Mike Trout. Captain, He's Captain America. America. And when yeah. Team USA got their backs against the wall, somebody needed to step up, and it was Mike Trout against Team Canada, hitting his first home run in this tournament, 
rounding the bases, getting to home plate, stopping, saluting to the crowd, saluting to his team, wearing the red, white, and blue. He talked after the game about how the most fun he has ever had on a baseball field is rocking the red, white, and blue for Team USA and doing that salute around the bases to his teammates. You could feel it. You could see it. One of the greatest baseball players of all time is having a blast wearing the wearing his country's colors, and that's number one for me. Team USA needed it. Captain America needed it. Ah, chef's kiss. It was great. It was crazy. And what I love, too, is that not only Mike Trout, we've heard Mookie Betts and other players on Team USA say that this is the most fun that they've ever had playing baseball. And especially for Mike Trout, and I've said this from the beginning, I believe Team USA will win this entire tournament because Mike Trout has never had an opportunity to legitimately compete for a championship yeah he's only played in three playoff games he's lost all three he has his moment right now he's the captain captain america of team usa if they want to win tomorrow he has to show up have the game of his life and everyone else has to follow suit everyone else has to follow suit